So I began sharing my story of overcoming sexual trauma probably about five, maybe six years ago. And just throughout the journey of sharing, it's like um, regaining my voice, uh, learning that I have a community of people um, who've had very similar experiences to me and it reaffirmed to me that I've never been alone. Even when the events first took place, um, I wasn't uh, isolated on an island all by myself. Um, there were many other people out there who had sh you know, shared the same experiences as I have. And so I found that in sharing my story, I was also giving voice to other men um, who are um, s trapped in silence or afraid to share their stories and connecting with them has been so empowering. Um, and the more that I share, I also find the more that I heal, the more that I learn to put vocabulary to my experience, um, the more it humanizes my experiences. Um, and I continue to share because of the lives that I'm able to, to reach, to inspire, to empower, to help other men on their journey to wholeness, even if it, it's not a get them from A to Z thing. Some people just need help getting from A to B. And so um, I shared to help people because I have a heart to help people to, to heal, um, to let them know that they're not alone and that they don't have to live lives that are stained by the effects of their sexual trauma.